Hi, we're here with Miro and Ian, and they're both from ETH Zurich. That's a school that won the uh, an award here at NI Week for their stair climbing wheelchair. Miro, Ian, um, tell us a little bit about how you uh, in, how you made the wheelchair and what gave you the idea to come up with a, a wheelchair that could stunt climb ch uh, stairs. So. In Zurich, there are a lot of stairs, and we have a friend um, who also studies mechanical engineering, just like us, and he's in the wheelchair. So we thought, well, he can't climb stairs, and it's a shame. And during our last year at ETH Zurich, we have the opportunity to realize a project and create a product from scratch. So we thought, well, let's just create a stair climbing wheelchair. Interesting. You've, you've combined a, a track um, system with a set of wheels. Tell us a little bit about how you did that. Well, we thought about various concepts and in the end we ended up with the tracks because uh, it is really uh, good for climbing stairs. You have a bigger area to stand on, so it's a lot more safer to climb the stairs. And you also the approach the stairs backwards. Uh, tell us a little bit about the sequence you go through to climb a set of stairs. Yeah, right. So actually when you drive around, you're balancing on two wheels like a Segway. Uh, and you face forwards. Then we have a couple of sensors and the idea is that it works all automatically. So you ch push just one button on the touch screen and then it automatically will take a turn so that it can ascend backwards. And uh, there you can tilt down the tracks. It is all done automatically, as I said. Uh, and then it just starts uh, driving uh, up the stairs. In the end, uh, to avoid tipping over from the tracks, um, we have a support system on the back which are uh, two small wheels that we can then lower and make a smooth transition on the top. Tell us a little bit about the electric motors and the drivetrain system you came up with for this. So this is a really uh, unique system because we actually use chains to power all our drive wheels and um, we use the same motors for the tracks as well as the drive wheels. Um, and the special thing is we have a clutch implemented between the tracks and the wheels. So the wheels are always turning, but while balancing, we can um, clutch out the tracks, so only the wheels turn. But when we want to go on the stairs, the clutch goes uh, together, and the tracks start to turn, and everything uh, works fine, yeah. What's the motor technology? We use Maxim Motors EC60, uh, 400 watts on each side, yeah. Those are brushless DC motors? Exactly. They are great. They are really great for control um, because we have very accurate encoders, which is really important for balancing on two wheels. Hmm. Uh, tell us a little bit about the, the clutch. Is that something you designed yourselves? It is actually a clutch which we um, received from KTR. Um, they are clutch manufacturing, but we, we had to um, develop a solution to clutch automatically. So we ad added two servo motors with levers with which we then can clutch automatically. Yes. And you're going to do more work on the, uh, the wheelchair. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Um, yeah, so right now we've finished with the project in the university. Uh, we got a lot of positive feedback about the wheelchair, so uh, a couple of us in the team are thinking about maybe in two years or so making a startup. And yeah, we are really eager to completely um, optimize it to maybe make something more about it. That's interesting. Um, you're about to give us a demo here. Why don't, you, why don't we do that? Yeah. yeah, sounds great. All right. So right now we're in the stable balancing position. You can lean forward and accelerate and brake by leaning back. So it's just like a segue. You can control the movement with your body which leads to a very dynamic feeling. And safety is very important to us, especially during early testing. So we have this huge red button for an emergency stop. Using the controller in Jan's hand, um, you can now turn. So the, the very nice thing about balancing it is that you can turn on spot and be very agile, especially indoors. All right, so 
Now, if you want to get up and, I don't know, change the position, we lower the tracks and the support system. You can just take the armrest on your left side, push it forward, and now you can get up over this side. So what's also special is we can extend the tracks and the support system so the wheelchair seat gets brought up about 30 centimeters. This way the wheelchair driver can communicate almost on eye height with the other people like this. So if you're at the bar, you can just have a drink with your mates and it's, it's really awesome. Well, guys, that was very interesting, and uh, congratulations on uh, winning the top prize here, too. Thank you very much. Thanks.